Hi folks, I'm Highlander.com and Galaxy S4 Root.com where we get hot on Android every day. Uh, just a quick update for those of you with Verizon Galaxy S4 and um, you either have Clock Mod Recovery or Tor Recovery installed. Uh, with MDK Bootloader, this is for those of you with an Unlock Bootloader. Uh, you know, some of you actually asked me uh, to install the latest uh, Android Lollipop. So you can install this ROM called EGRLP ROM. Uh, this one I recommend, this is based on the latest uh, Verizon firmware. Um, so you get that and also you'll be able to install it easily using Torp Recovery. Uh, I do recommend this one because if you try to unroot to Lollipop, you'll lose your uh, bootloader and you won't be able to install AOSP ROMs. It just makes it worse. But you can just simply install this one. This one's also very debloated, as you can see. Uh, some of the extra apps, uh, it comes obviously super SU for root. You may have to update it when you first install it. So uh, if it ask you to update, just choose normal and, um, and it will update. Other than that, it's also got Viper for Android. Uh, this one actually is slightly modded. It's not completely stock. It also has Hydro Max uh, custom kernel. It doesn't have any overclocking, but uh, it seems to get pretty good battery life and performance. Also comes with kernel tweaker app. Um, you can go ahead and use Viper for Android for tweaking your sound. Uh, mobile spot hotspot seems to be working out of the box for me, at least. And I have grandfathered uh, a limited plan. So it should work for most of you guys, I think. Um, other than that, uh, that's pretty much it. Definitely check it out. Pretty good ROM. And I'll definitely feature another AOSP ROM soon here, uh, probably next week. Um, but if you want to run TouchWiz, this is a bare bones ROM. And it has just the apps you need. And also there are some performance tweaks. So you should be faster. Or it should be much faster than a uh, stock. You don't get all that Verizon blower. Look, it's very, very simple. Uh, nice and lightweight uh, for those of you who want to run the latest TouchWiz. So definitely check it out uh, if this is your cup of tea. And do let me know if you have a Verizon S4. And I'm still trying to update all the different phones. I'm just going in series because if I jump back and forth, I just lose track because, you know, my sites, I have so many models, so many different requests. Uh, so I'm just going from S2 to S3. Now I'm doing S4. As soon as I'm done with this, I'm going to go back to the note series, do all the notes, and then I'm going to do the HT1 series. And then I'm going to do all the Nexus series. Um, this way I sort of get in a, a you know, uh, what is it, habit of a schedule, um, so you guys can get some ROM updates for those of you waiting on me. Anyway, um, definitely check it out, and I have more ROMs coming uh, for the S4, obviously. Today is the S4 day, and of course, camera should be working just fine, and it's updating camera firmer, um, but that should be fine. Anyway, I'll see you guys soon, as always. I'll stay on Android.